The BBC Symphony Orchestra's Total Immersion Days at the Barbican are inspirational events that give you the chance to get to the very heart of a composer's music and their creative world. This isn't just about what sounds they make, but about what they mean, illuminated through talks and discussions, as well as the concerts. In February, the orchestra celebrates the 85th birthday of Scottish composer Thea Musgrave and her music, her engagingly expressive music, that's inspired by everything from Turner landscapes to Scottish folk songs. They are doing a total immersion day of Thea Musgrave's music, who I've worked with quite a bit and, and love her stuff. And it's got a completely different, fresh, well, interesting feel. Um, it's quite naive in a sense, but just really, really uh, charming and winsome. She's completely different from anybody else I know, so I'm really looking forward to seeing Thea. This is music that sings, that's direct, dramatic in the way that it communicates to us audiences. The BBC Symphony Orchestra will be conducted by Martin Brabins. Martin Brabins is one of the most versatile conductors I know. We're going to be working on the Thea Musgrave Horn Concerto. From a horn player's point of view, she was one of the first composers who really wrote with quarter tones in mind. A lot of the time when you hear the horn, you, ha you have this harmonic series which goes sort of... and you hear that note, so it's just a little bit out of tune, but she uses all the notes of the instrument uh, and using quarter tones in between them, so it's, it's kind of like breaking down another boundary. Now, while I'm playing these notes, and uh, more notes than I would usually expect to play in a concerto, uh, we have the other horns and uh, a couple of trumpets and a trombone as well. They're interjecting after I play a lot of the time. It's almost like they're trying to spoil the party, or they're mocking me in some, some strange, peculiar way. But um, it really adds to the piece, it adds a lot of drama to it. Throughout the day, you'll hear the vivid range of Thea Musgrave's music, symphonic works, choral music from the BBC Singers, and chamber works from the Guildhall New Music Ensemble.